Okay. I'll talk to talk to some people early in the morning and confirm that. Okay. Um, how did Bray look? Good. Real good. Yeah. He looked confident and uh, you know, about as good as you can. So that was, that was nice to see. With uh, Yanic, what kind, uh, how did he play and what kind of spark do you hope he uh, gives you guys? Well, he, he looked good. You know, of course, he you know, he's, was having a, a, a solid start to the season before he got hurt, so it's nice to see him back out there. He, you know, it's never fun to be hurt, but he went about everything as well as you possibly can. So I expect him to, to pick up right, you know, where he left off. Um, you know, he was out a long time, but um, you know, he's like I said, he handled everything great. He stayed as ready as he could. He stayed in in the game, involved with the team, and um, you know, just a real professional. So that's going to pay off for him. And uh, Soto, how long do you expect him to be out? Uh, we're hoping, um, you know, he's, he's on the disabled list, but uh, I think he could come back as early as next Tuesday, mm-hmm. right around there. We're hoping, you know, he's ready then. So hopefully So you don't think it or think it's anything serious? No, it's just, it, well, it, you know, back spasms. And, mm-hmm. um, you know, I think, I think he's going to do some strengthening stuff, and, and it's already feeling better. So he could be back, and maybe he won't have to deal with it the rest of the year. I want to lay us with Phipps. I think he's uh, a couple weeks away now, mm-hmm. and he's going to start playing here soon, any right. day. And uh, you know, not playing. I'm sorry, baseball activity, mm-hmm. and then start playing. And then, you know, so we're hoping two or three weeks, maybe. Okay. Uh, How much longer for Tom Phipps? Uh, he's going to start a progression now. He's going to probably throw as early as Saturday, just uh, nice and easy. Take it from there. So, really, no timetable yet on him, but he's feeling a lot better. Just what are your thoughts on tonight's game? You guys had that lead, and then uh, they come back, and then you guys come back. Yeah, it was a pretty good. You know, it was a good game. Um, you know, unfortunately, we, we did not win, but it was a good game. I, I felt like our offense played well. Um, you know, Dorn had a good night. Looked great at the plate. Some good things happened. Um, we, uh, I felt like we were going to win the game, the, the entire game, and we had uh, our guys out there that we wanted in there uh, from a pitching standpoint. But, you know, if we continue to play like that, we're going we're gonna to get wins. How much, uh, I mean, how, I'm sure you're used to it, but, not, but how much is the roster juggling with guys, you know, rehab stints and guys, you know, getting hurt and guys getting healthy? How, how difficult has that been over the past few days? Yeah. Yeah. Um, you know, it, it, like you said, it, it's something that you, you expect, and uh, you know, guys are handling it great, and they're, they're ready to play. And it hasn't been too much of a factor, you know, just because it's part of the, the experience here, you know, for all the teams in AAA. Mm-hmm. Is that the part that makes AAA the most challenge, or a little bit different as opposed to major league managing, where you have to worry about, you know, certain allotted times or you know playing time, that, mm-hmm. as opposed to just you know. A regular game. Yeah, you know that's that's part of it, like, and uh, a whole different set of challenges <laughs> in the major leagues, I'm sure. But uh, you know, it's it's uh, part of the AAA. Uh, and, and the good thing is, is when you know guys are going up to the big leagues and mm-hmm. things like that. That's that's what it's all about. It's been yeah, you're been kind of feast or famine for Obispo lately. You know, he goes yeah. to.